New at 6, a Pawtucket man is critically injured in a fiery crash. The Pinpoint News Tracker takes you to the scene just over the westerly border in North Stonington, Connecticut. Investigators say John Martins was driving a heavy-duty tow truck from another crash when he blew a tire and crashed into a tree. Thankfully, a group of Good Samaritans were able to help him get away from the flames. Eyewitness News reporter Perry Russom joins us now live outside Rhode Island Hospital in Providence. The Pawtucket man who was driving that heavy duty wrecker was airlifted here to Rhode Island Hospital and he is listed in critical condition. Connecticut State Police say a man from Pawtucket was working for his towing company Friday morning when his heavy duty wrecker crashed on I 95 North in North Stonington, catching on fire. Troopers say John Martins just finished clearing up a bus crash on the highway when his truck blew a tire, it veered off the road, and went down a 1,000 foot embankment, crashing into a tree. Hey, I'm from the country back in Virginia. I'm not used to this, but this is, yeah, it is what it is. You know, we're better off than the people who were in the accident. Martins is a 52 year old and a business owner in the area running Sterry Street Towing and courtesy Kia in South Attleboro. Troopers say when the wrecker crashed into a tree, it caught on fire, grabbing the attention of about a half dozen people who pulled over to the side of the highway to help. Martins was taken from the burning truck and given first aid as a medical helicopter landed to take him to Rhode Island Hospital. And the highway was closed for a few hours as the fire was put out and DOT inspected the scene. Live in Providence with the Mobile Newsroom, Perry Russell, Eyewitness News.